and bam. Like bam, 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 bam. <laughs> Just don't make them like you Cause you do your own makeup And you got your cake up Body insane, hair is amazing You got the glow, you're gonna make it Skin is so soft, what are you taking? Aisha Mariah Hey dolls, welcome back to my channel Thank you so much for tuning in I know I look crazy, but today is um a maintenance day I just got home from the gym Skin was good. Um, I'm about to go to baby's house, Patty M, um, and we're gonna do my hair. Let me go find some earrings too, but I'll see you guys at Patty's house. So guys, I'm at Patty's M's and we're about to get started on this hair. Like the shrinkage is real. <laughs> Shout out to all my girls that are rocking their natural hair. It took me a very long time to go full out natural and I absolutely love it. Like my hair is thick, it's soft. I definitely do have curls. They just really, really dry and dehydrated right now. But we're gonna get that together. We're gonna give me a good gym friendly hairstyle because I am in reset mode and I am training in the gym. So we wanted to make sure that I can be cute and still train hard. And I, I can't do that with my natural hair out because it would just get tangled and the breakage would be real. So we're going to do something <laughs> creative and cute. I always let Patty M have the full creative direction when it comes to my hairstyle. So we're just going to see what she gives. <laughs> Today. Every time I forget you have so much hair. It's a lot. But it's a challenge. I like challenges. Cause hairstylists these days be going off about natural hair. So I seen on the shade room some girl um asked the lady for box braids and the hairstylist replied to her and was like, Do you have nappy hair? Or did she ask her for a sleek ponytail or something like that? She and asked her if her hair was nappy. That's so not That's cool. disrespectful. Very. That is disrespectful to the limit, to the max, and to the, to the limit. The most that hairstylist ever t told me was, don't you want to perm? Don't you want to go perm your hair? No, I like my natural. What's wrong with people? You messing up this good, good, nice coil right here. Mm. I know for sure one person will be like, oh, I saw this on Aisha's head. And <laughs> I need this style. I need this service. I don't see it on your website. <laughs> what what would we call this? Half up, half down. Well, it's a um it's basically a ponytail with box rays in the front. Give it your own signature name on the style C. Ooh, this looks really good. Ooh, this is fun.
halfway through or at least like 75% of the way through, I just wanted to let you guys know that today's video is sponsored by Ellen Beauty Hair. And obviously this isn't a sew win because there's so much you can do with bundles aside from getting it sewed into your hair. So we're going to do a natural ponytail. And bam. Like bam, 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 bam. I love it. P money for the wind did her thing. The hair is amazing. It feels so good and it's just giving life. What do you guys think? Give me a thumbs up if you like this style. What you think? I love it. It's 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Period. Oh yeah, eyebrows. Oh my eyebrows. Patty M is responsible for doing my eyebrows. No one else can ever touch. Yeah. Look at this. No one else can ever touch my eyebrows. Cause she doesn't take it all off. She just like she touches it up. it up. Real cute. Real simple. Real fast. Nothing extra. Nothing less. My gosh, I'm just here on my phone looking at all of this stuff from Atlanta All-Star Weekend and it's making me itch. What happened to us being in a whole pandemic? They forgot about that part. They really did. What is this pandemic? Didn't um, Ter Terrence J talk about we survived the pandemic? And yeah, Terrence J. in it. So while we survived the pandemic. No, we did not. We're, We're still, still in, in it. Shit. And you know, it's because they got money. So they, they, that's why they saying that. Yeah, I also don't know if I should talk about this on this platform, but... Are you guys gonna get vaccinated? Let me know in the comment section below because it's still up in the air for me. Yeah, me too. I don't know about that. All right. This is what the brows is giving right now. See you guys in five minutes. See you guys in five minutes. <laughs> so refreshed all i have to do is go home and wash my face yes, hey doll so it's the very next day my head is so tight um i went to the gym i just got back from the gym i got that gym glow right now i'm actually about to take a shower and i'm setting up to film some sponsored content shout out to your girl for getting sponsored content your girl is getting paid for content now I'm so hype about this because this just means that brands are seeing my content and they're recognizing me and they're using me in the right way so I'm so happy about that I made some matcha green tea so I'm gonna go drink on that mm. cheers <laughs> so this matcha green tea my tea vendor actually sent me some samples. I love matcha. Matcha is so good for you. I don't know if I'm going to add it to the brand, but I've been sampling it. It tastes so good, and it makes me feel so energized. It's better than coffee. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's the froth for me. Mm. Okay, let me go take a shower and switch it up hey guys i'm fresh out the shower uh what time it is it's 1 30. i'm currently waiting on justin to bring me some food but in the meantime in between time um here i have my get shit done list and here i have my <laughs> list full of content that i have scheduled for this month so make sure you subscribe to the channel because i have a lot to upload so i really like this get shit done list let me show you guys what it actually looks like this is what it looks like i got it from amazon i will link it in the description box below it helps me stay organized so it has like your water intake your priorities for the day what's this noteworthy shit today's achievements your schedule to do for the day and of course your health and fitness and it's a whole notepad so that you can stay up to date with the shit that you got to get done 
throughout the month the week the year whatever i bought a couple of these so when this finishes i can you know continue and this also helps me stay on track this also helps me hold myself accountable for content and everything else that i have to do i like being organized so that's a must have something else that i have and really like that keeps me all the way organized is this weekly planner which i also got from amazon and it basically has monday through sunday and next week so here's where i would normally write my ideas down and the content that i do want to film and things that i need to get done on specific days of the week and then the get shit done list which is this one i use this notepad every night and every morning and throughout the day so this is something that i use on sundays to basically map out what i want to do for the entire week really good for that and it's always good to write things down it's like when you write things down it's easier to manifest it's like your subconscious already like locks it in and takes mental note of whatever it is that you're writing down so i love to write shit down just putting it in my notes doesn't do it for me because a lot of my stuff gets lost <laughs> in my notes because i'm always writing so much inside of the phone so that's a no go for me i need to visually and physically see it in front of me it keeps me motivated and i also feel super duper duper important when i write down what i have to do so get you these two notepads from amazon again the link will be in my description box below okay guys i'm back and i am in the middle of filming justin say what's up what's up y'all <laughs> so i have 10 minutes of grace time until it's time to rinse this mask off and then get back to filming so whew, it's getting tighter by the minute oh look at the skin Yes, I just came back looking like a brand new woman. What you think, babe? You look amazing, babe. I look good. Mm -hmm. I look good. Um, so this face mask is bomb.com. I'm not going to get into it in this video because there's a link right at the top of the screen for you to go check out the actual video of me reviewing that face mask for Gleam and make sure you go check it out. Oh my God. I'm hungry now though. You hungry? Mm -hmm. I'm starving. Let's go see what Justin bought me to eat. Guys, look at what Justin surprised me with. So these are leggings from Skims. Yeah, I know Skims, Kim Kardashian's brand. And this is the seasonal color that I've been waiting on forever. This is the only color from the seasonal colors that I don't have. I have almost every color in these leggings. Well, every good color that I personally like. This is in the shade Deep Sea. It's giving like a hunter green for me. And I love it. It was so hard to get my hands on these. Then she restocked and my boo thing got them for me. I'm also wearing a pair of Skims leggings right now. They're so comfortable. So I will be doing a haul on that soon. So stay tuned for that. Look at my skin. It's glowing. So I just separated the salad from the salmon. I'm gonna put the salmon in the microwave for about a minute. Start, and then we're gonna work on my salad. So here's my salad dressing. I don't like too much of that, but I like every leaf to have salad dressing on it which is why i do this with my salads so i'm gonna toss my salad with this just like that to make sure that every single leaf gets dressing <laughs> then i'm gonna get my salad bowl i'm gonna pour all my salad in there then I'm going to add my salmon. Voila. Doesn't it look so yummy? And now I can eat my salad like a Kardashian. Mm, 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 mm. 
Mm. So, I went vegan for a whole week last week. Silly me, I didn't record it, so I'm going to do it again for a whole nother week, and I'm going to record it because I lost so much weight going vegan and working out every single day. I actually have some bomb results, which I'm going to share with you guys right now. Look at this. Look at that. If you guys want to know exactly what I ate and what I did to achieve that five-day transformation, then make sure you're following me on Instagram, of course, because I post the most there. And also, I'm going to let you know from now, if you haven't already purchased your Reset Body Cleanse, what are you waiting for? Because this detox tea right here is a game changer yeah. so i just got done eating and mommy just came home from therapy tell tell him what happened i was trying to park my car and this guy came up to me and asked me to move my car to go in the crosswalk so i was like no i don't want to go in the crosswalk to get a ticket and then he was like okay move back and go on the hydrant i'm like why would i do that i would get more of an expensive ticket and he was like oh you for I bitch. you for I bitch. you're gonna pay for this I was so shocked I didn't even know how to respond tears filled my eyes and then I'm like he's a bitch. my face fell to the floor men should not speak to women like that under any circumstances he's a freaking mm -hmm. and I feel bad me too it hurt me I couldn't wait to come home to tell you this story let's give him the middle finger guy can you believe it? But on a positive note, I didn't get to share with you guys that my mom is officially a doctor. She got her PhD. When was this? Last week? February 25th at 2 p.m. Okay, two weeks ago. <laughs> February 25th at 2 p.m. My mom became a doctor of education. Yes. She also has a double master's in education and special education. Yes. So shout outs to her for all of her accomplishments. I need you guys to flood the comment section and say congratulations. Congratulations, Dr. Mommy! And thank you for praying for me. Yes, thank you guys so much for praying for my mom. Um, if you're new to my channel and you don't know, my mom was diagnosed with stage 4 metastatic, metastatic. metastatic breast cancer. Um, how far in were you with your PhD? She started her PhD first and then how long after? It was two years in. She was two years in um, studying for her PhD and then she got diagnosed with breast cancer stage four and it was a very 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 rough journey but she never let that deter her or take her away from her dream which is becoming a doctor of education and she did that so my mom is a walking testament to strength and never giving up on your dreams and how great god is and how great god is for sure because without god she would not be here today so i want to thank god and all of you and everyone that prayed for her during that journey because we were very transparent with it yes. and it wasn't a good journey it was real graphic and my mom pulled through not only for me and people around her but for her title which is dr mommy yes so i'm so proud of you and you should be very proud of yourself. And middle finger to that a-hole who tried to come at you today and disrespect you. And I wish I was Over there. Over a parking. Over a parking spot. That's so disgusting. That wasn't even his. Ugh. I, I wish I was there. I'd have, I'd have punctured his tire. I wanted to cry. I'd have punched him in his face too. You would have cried too. Yeah, I'd have cried too. <laughs> I'm soft, but my mom is softer, and I don't like people messing with her. So, if you just so happen to see this video, sir, don't you ever take God out your thoughts to speak to my mom like that again. Okay? Period. Period. It's actually a really nice day out in Brooklyn right now. Um, we got a lot to do today, starting off with getting tested. I'm so sorry for the noise in the background. The gentrification in the neighborhood is at an all-time high, so the construction is at its max, especially since it's getting warmer outside. The workers are out. But, yeah, so the last time I got tested was earlier last year. 
when the pandemic had first hit its peak. Um, I tested, I did the blood test, which was very rapid. I got my results back in like 15 minutes and um, I tested negative for both the virus and any antibodies, which means that I never had the virus. So um, I was good throughout the entire year. Didn't get sick, didn't catch a cold. I never had any symptoms, but now, um, now it's i think it's time because life is getting back to normal you know they have the vaccine out so i want to get tested for safety precautions both myself and justin we're about to go get a quick rapid test and you guys are going to come along with us Here's the testing site, guys. We pulling up. Windows up. And I guess we have to have our mask on, so let me put my mask on. All right, guys, we're in here, and this is so weird. Like, this is so freaking weird. This feels so crazy to me right now. But I guess this is what gotta be done. Oh, I'm scared. This is scary. Oh my goodness, look at this. This is crazy. Have you had this done before? No, first time. First time. Okay. So, do me a favor, follow these instructions, and this is how you can get your results, correct? Right? Three to four days, okay? Gotcha. Oh, they are rude. Look straight ahead, cover your mouth. Cover your mouth. With your, with your, there you go. Now look up, all the way up in the ceiling. Okay, this is gonna feel a little uncomfortable, okay? Okay. So, give me a minute. I want my results back today. They took about three to four days. I want it back today. They're constantly switching their gloves, which is very, very, very important. That was so uncomfortable, guys. I'm sorry I didn't get footage of myself being recorded. I didn't get the footage of myself um, getting the nose test, but it was really, really uncomfortable. It actually burned. And at this point, I'm just annoyed. It's like five o'clock now. I had a lymphatic massage at six o'clock, but I had to cancel it because the caviation and the radio frequency machines that they use causes the menstrual to come down heavier, being that it's draining your body from like fats and toxins. So unfortunately, I'm unable to get my massage today, which I really, really wanted. Like I wanted that massage so bad because i've been in the gym and i've been doing so good so i'm like let me treat myself with a little massage now i have to wait until this time of the month is over so we'll be doing that next um next week now i'm just printing out shipping labels and order sheets also think i'm single now because i totally pms earlier <laughs> pmsing is real Ah, today is just not it for me. It's, it's just not it. It's not happening. It's not a good day today. So printing labels might definitely be my favorite part. Printing while well, packaging and shipping and packaging is my favorite part of having my business. I'm going to tap into this real quick and then I'm going to just speed up the next few clips so that you guys can see what's going down in the reset lounge right now.
guys i'm snacking right now and i'm snacking on like a mixed cup of nuts and cranberries i don't even know why i just smirked but i'm <laughs> i am snacking on some dry nuts they're just regularly roasted no salt here's a little secret if you're trying to lose weight go on a low sodium and carb diet sodium salt it causes lots of inflammation and water retention so most of our weight be water weight and we be thinking that we're just like fat but it's definitely water weight which is caused by the overconsumption of salty foods so that is a little sneaky tip that i have for you ladies Cutting down on the salt has helped me dramatically. These are so delicious. And it's so healthy. It has sunflower seeds, almonds, peanuts, cranberries, pumpkin seeds, and I think um, walnuts. And I hate walnuts, but they're so good in this mix. I feel so busy today because I'm doing my business taxes. I'm doing my business taxes, guys. It's a lot of money. And one more important thing that I wanted to talk about in this video before I close it off. This one in particular is for my customers who I love, love, love so much. And it makes me so sad when you guys don't double check your shipping info when checking out on my website. Because when you put an insufficient or like incorrect or incomplete mailing address if you live in an apartment building and you neglect to put your apartment number guess what US Postal is gonna send the packages right back to me and then it makes me sad because that delays your experience that delays your detox that delays your reset and that delays you reaching your body goals. And we don't want that. We don't want that. So please, 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 guys, please. Double check your shipping info. Now I'm going to leave you guys with this because my camera is dying. Thank you guys so much for tuning into my first ever weekly vlog. Give me a thumbs up if you guys would like to see more vlogs like this. Let me know in my comment section what other type of content you'd like to see from me and don't forget to reset your body shop my body reset brand and i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys next week or in my next video bye dolls Aisha Mariah, Aisha Mariah, Aisha Mariah